Fluval Accent Aquarium. Oh, it's great. Yeah, so let's lift it out carefully. It's not very heavy, so don't worry. Okay. Let's take it in. So do you know where you want to put it? I have the perfect spot for it. Awesome. All right, so you want it in the corner, right? Yes. So the cool thing about the accent is that it comes complete with everything that you need. Um, lights, filtration system, heater, water conditioner, all you need to add is the, the decorations and the fish. I'm so glad you're here to help me put it together. I, I'm not putting it together. You are. You know, the accent was actually made for people to be able to put it together really easily and in under an hour you'll have a set up aquarium. Oh, great. So we're going to set up the filter now. I'm going to show you how that's done. We're taking off the, the canopy here. Yeah, there we go. So this is the entire filter unit. Everything is self-contained in here. This is the filter cartridge. It has uh, a fine mechanical filter to remove particulates, and it has carbon to remove toxins. How often do I need to change a cartridge? You're going to change the cartridge once a month. And the, the way to do the maintenance, we're going we're gonna to go through this later on, but everything gets done once a month. You're going to change the cartridge, and you're going to change two buckets full of water using the SimpleTech um, water change method, and I'll show you how that works. Great. Okay. All right, Gila, can you give me a hand? Of I'm course. going to uh, have you put in this. Perfect. Great. So what, the, what this stuff does is Bacteria actually will colonize this and break down the fish waste. So it's a very, very important part of the uh, filtration system. You don't have to, to clean this because when you actually change the water using the SimpleTech uh, system, it automatically flushes out this chamber. So no need to clean the, all those ceramic media. So we're going to do the heater now. Okay, heater is super easy. It just slides in there. No need to, um, to adjust it. It's already been preset to the right temperature for you. OK? So that's the heater. The next part is we're going to get the siphon hose. If you can grab that. So the siphon hose is really important for the system. This is actually how you'll do your water changes. And it automatically back flushes the bio chamber as well. So you're going to take this and just slide it inside, making sure that the slots align. Sure. All right, so just put the, fil the siphon tube in there. Perfect. All right, so now we're going to take this and hang it back onto the aquarium. Perfect. OK, so the filtration system is set. Now we're going to have to pla th place this aquarium on the stand. Great. I love the design of this stand and this espresso finish. It's going to look great in the spot. Sure will. It was super simple to put it together. Yeah, yeah. There it is. It looks like it was made for the spot. Looks great, right? Yes. Awesome. Great. Okay. Watch your fingers. Perfect. So you remember this, this hose that we put on yes. earlier? This is how the aquarium uh, drains and does its own self-water change. So you can see here, there's a hole. OK. So these are some of the Fluval Aquascape and Decor items, which uh, fit perfectly inside the accent. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to place some pre-washed gravel on the bottom, and then put the plants in there and you know the best thing about these plants you don't even need to water them. All right, so this is the LED light. It uh, has a couple different settings. It has a full daylight and it also has a moonlight setting that's blue so you can watch the fish in the evenings, it's really, really cool. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna fill it with water. All right, now it's full of water. We're gonna test the SimpleTech system. So this is what really makes the tank unique. It's 
how easy it is to change the water. So why don't you um, press down on this and okay. see if it works. Press down, there it is. Oh wow, that's okay. really cool. It comes out like a water dispenser. Exactly. To do the maintenance on this aquarium, it take about 10 minutes per month. What we have is, is called the, the two, 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 one, one rule. Two buckets of water out, so empty two buckets of water, fill two buckets of water up with, with fresh water, add them to the aquarium, you add two water conditioners, which come in the renewal kit, and then you change the cartridge, one cartridge every month. So once a month, you do the two, 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 one, one, and it should take you no more than 10 minutes. Sounds easy. It is. Can we put the fish in now? I, I prefer to wait a couple days before putting the fish in, but um, what you're gonna do is you're gonna add the fish in there, and I'm gonna come back in two months. You're gonna do the first water change in a month, in two months, I'm going to come back and I'm going to show you how to gravel clean the aquarium, which is um, just another quick step for the, for the regular maintenance of it. Oh, wow. The tank looks great. Yes, and I even think there's a few babies back here. Nice, nice. So it's been two months. Did you remember to do the water change? I did. I changed two buckets of water and the cartridge, and it really took less than 10 minutes. Okay, so you did that after the first month, right? I did. Okay, now that it's two months later, what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna do a quick gravel cleaning. We're gonna use this vacuum and vacuum up some of the fish waste. Now, we're gonna use the same bucket here that we use, and um, really, really simple. So what we're gonna do is you're gonna systematically clean the gravel. You can see, just put it into one spot, Stop when it runs clear, move to the next spot, and you're gonna do that through the whole aquarium. And it um, should only take you a few minutes. All right, so I'm gonna give you the siphon, put your hand over it like that. Step it into here and just systematically go and vacuum until it, it runs clear. All right, so into the bucket, there you go. Yep, slowly into one spot, now it's clear, move to the next spot. Perfect. I mean, it's just like vacuuming your house, right? Yeah, it's very simple. Perfect. All right, so you vacuum the whole tank. We'll just put this back into the into place. And that didn't add too much time to at all, did it? Not at all. Okay, excellent. Well, now you've already changed one bucket worth of water using the gravel siphon. The remainder, just use the simple tank. Okay, great. That sounds so simple. It is. And you know, Another important thing is every time you use this simple tech system, it's at the same time cleaning that uh, biofilter media. It's flushing that, removing all of the waste that could have been trapped in there. So you're doing kind of double maintenance every time you use this system. So every month, two buckets of water removed. Every other month, you can use the gravel cleaner to quickly remove some of the, we call detritus. And then, you know, if you've only taken one bucket worth of, of water out using the siphon, you can use the remainder with the simple tech system. It's been so user friendly, so easy to maintain. It's less than 10 minutes a month and we've really enjoyed it a lot. And, and the fish are doing well. The fish are doing great.